Welcome back to Ace Movie Channel. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe our channel and ring the bell so you never miss a video. Today I'm gonna show you how to make your own intro with text templates and elements in Ace Movie. You can also use it to customize the intro or lower thirds, etc. Go ahead and comment down below that more tutorials you'd like to see from us. In the Media tab, you can click the import to import the audio or the logo you want to make the intro, or you can click the audio tab to choose the background music you like. Next, I'll show you how to make your intro with the text template. Let's click the text tabs. Here we can see lots of text templates, static text and dynamic text. Hanging on the templates, you can preview the animation, or you can add it to the timeline to see the details. Then let's go to the right side, in the transform, click this little yellow button, we'll enter the advanced edit, you can adjust this text template. In the timeline, you can change each of the track, here we have the text and video, let's click the text and go to the right side, we can change the font, size, font style, etc of the text, and here, you can choose one of the style for your text, just click the style. Next. Let's click on this video too and change its scale and position. You can also set position or other parameters in the transform section. Let's click the color. Here you can change the color of your video. Let's go back to the timeline. Here click this button. You can add a new text track on the timeline. Or you can add the image and video to the timeline. You can also change the duration of the image, text and other video just like that. Dragging the image to the right or left you can see the start time and duration is changing. Here, I'll add a new text track by clicking it. Let's drag this text to the button of the screen, and change its font, size, etc. here. Then go to the left side. Here we have many animation for the text. Just hanging on the animation, you can preview it, and find the animation you like, and drag it to the text, by dragging the animation on the text you can change the duration of the animation. Alright, let's click to play and see what it looks like. Click the OK. You can keep the intro on the timeline. If you want to change, just click here, you can change it again. Next, let's add the logo to the timeline, then dragging the logo to change its size and position. Then we can click the keyframe here, and move the playhead to the start of the logo. Click the keyframe again, and we can see the animation section on the right side. Let's set the opacity to zero, then click to play to see the animation. The logo appears slowly, that's what I want the logo looks like, and we can change the duration of the animate in by dragging the keyframe, or move back the logo. Let's click to play it. That's one ways to make the intro. Next I'll show you the other way to do it. That's use the text template and the elements. First, go to the text template. Here you can choose the template you like, add it to the timeline. Let's open the advanced edit and delete the text. Just keep the background of the text template. Then go to the elements tab. I like this gradient background, add it to the timeline and change its scale. Let's add the keyframe to it to make it appear slowly. And move it back a few frames. There are lots of funny stickers you can use for your video intro. If your video is a vlog, here are some vlog sticker you can add it to your video, just like this one. Next add your logo to the timeline, shrink the logo and place it in the upper left corner. Let's add some keyframes on logo 2. To make it appear slowly, just like this gradient background. Finally, add the text to the timeline. I would like to use the dynamic text. Here I use this fall dynamic text and change its font and size. Apart from this, you can add other text template together. Just like that, add the title text template to timeline.
If you don't like this color, open its advanced edit, change its color to make the entire color of the intro video consistent. Simple put, it's to reuse different text template to make more diverse video intro. Delete some part of the text template you don't like on the advanced edit, and keep others, then add some stickers or element to make some animation. The core of the whole process is simple, when you know it all, you can take full advantage of these resources to make your cool video intro by yourself. That's it for today's video tutorial. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and ring the bell. Let us know what tutorials you'd like to see next in the comments below. Thanks for watching, see you next time.